The day is here. We mentioned uh, last week that we were gonna train with someone in New Jersey for the first time in a long time. Today's the day. We're waiting. And honestly, I'm kind of nervous, but it's been a while. <laughs> I'm friends with him, but like, it's still like cool as shit. Oh, I see him, dude. It's his car. He said orange Subaru. Yeah. I wore orange today just for him, bro. I thought he likes this color. I thought he liked this color. I thought it was his favorite <laughs> color, so I wore it. You said you're in his spot. Yeah. Oh. I like the car. It's not my first choice. Is orange your favorite color? No. What is it? For a car or just in general? In general. Red. Okay. Red would be second guess. You're shrunk. I do, dude. <laughs> it's probably the shoes. Put a lot of weight on my back, you know? Impresses the vertebrae. <laughs> Hello. Hello. How are you? Fantastic. I'm Pally. I don't know if we ever did, but a pleasure. I'm Nick. Alpha Elite crew. Yes. This is awesome. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. Hey, we are light. What do you have this on? I have it at the end range when I warm up. That's fine. Here we go. Um, yeah. So light. What are you doing? Are you still just warming up to your top set? Yeah, so what I, I do, I'll see how this feels. Yep. Um, I'm hoping this will be a warm up still. And then when I get to the work set, I'll do a couple of reps with it. And then go into the set next. Okay. I always found when you touch your working weight prior, your CNS system gets adjusted and it's not really a shock. Okay. So you're able to focus more on the muscle rather than that little initial uh, yep. that shake you got. That's a good tip. When did you find that in your training? Later Jared. On? Jared Feathers. Okay. He taught me that. So I'll probably, we'll probably do, I'll see how that first set feels. Yep. But it'll probably be two working sets here. Sure. And I want, I like to do flies 12 to 15. Yeah. That'll be good. Is that 270, right? Yeah, 270. Yeah. Oh yeah, come on. Get a nice big stretch and hold that for a second. And then let your chest guide you back up. There it is. Yes. Feel it? Think of only with your chest. Boom. Yes. There you go. Now we're working. Here we go. Come on. Down slow. Down slow. Let's get two more. Bring it up. Come on. Hold that. One, two, down slow. One more. One more. Control it. Yes. Stretch. Hold. Force. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Squeeze. Squeeze. Control back. Good. Oh. Oh. 
fucking bit. <laughs> oh. Ooh, I felt that one. What'd you just say? Fucking bullshit? Fucking bitch. Bitch. Fucking bitch. <laughs> that was good. Did you get 16? 12. 12, I was saying, I was a little short. That was good. No, it was good though. I know, it looks good. When you do yours, this set, what I want you to do is try to do what I did. Go back on that full stretch. And when you come up, instead of going like this. Yeah. If it helps, put your palms flat. Yeah. And then just come up and just squeeze here. Is your ass a little bit forward? Because when I'm here right now, okay. I put a little forward and I arch my shoulder just to let all my chest get that work. Yeah, I feel. And then just. Okay. <laughs> yes. Good. Yes. Pause. Good. Yep. There you go. Good. Come on. Come on. One more. One more. Down slow. Yes. Pause there. Yep. Come on. Come on. Squeeze. Squeeze that chest. Squeeze it hard. Down slow. Down slow. Whew. You got a pump? Pump. Okay. I got a pump too. Do you like um, inclined dumbbell? I haven't done it in a bit, I will say. Um, I could do it, it's probably gonna be my best. Huh. We'll get it. I'll show you how to do it. If you can actually, just for better rotation mobility, turn them to the side a little bit. Yes, this is more in line with the chest. Yeah. And then come all the way down and go as deep as you can with it. Let it stretch, yep. And then explode up. beautiful that's beautiful people miss the main portion is the stretch i'm all up for a quality squeeze but when you're able to stretch that shit hard and slightly pause i almost feel like it'll allow you to contract harder going up because your mind is now focused on getting the weight up and less trying to just move from a to b i mean listen that was a lot different than i've ever done before Usually I'm like just here and I'm like pump, pump, pump. No. No, dude, I've never done like this, like no. coming on my biceps almost. Creates a deep, nice stretch. It's me. Now with these, we, we will try to go a little heavier. You be careful, obviously. Don't push it if you don't feel comfortable, but round eight, eight to 10 for these. Yeah. <sighs> <sighs> oh. Oh. <sighs> yeah, we're getting strong. How'd that feel? I was nine. How many did you do? Nine. You do nine? That looked like you struggled there on nine. What's that? You struggle a little bit on there? On nine? Because I think I looked up when I didn't, I didn't stay focused in the front. I lost my groove. Let's do, how'd that feel though, contraction wise? It was good. good. Your top set, let's do, um, we'll do 85. Okay. <sighs> Oh yeah. 
That was smooth. Yes. It did look great. <laughs> Why was that funny? Yeah, yeah, it did look great. It did look good. I want to grow into the show. And I think now that even I got that food sensitivity test done, look, digestion and gut is like priority to growth, strength, sleep, recovery. And now that I got that done, I know what to eat and what not to eat, which my list of what not to eat is a lot larger. So it kind of makes it a little simpler to a degree. Um, but now I'm excited to see how that transfers for these last 12 weeks now. Um, so we'll see. Just sucks I can't have almond butter. That was literally four of my six meals. But it's, I have peanut butter and I'm like, it's not the same. Bro. Well, no, can't have it. Oh. Can't have it. Peanut is like the only one that was a go. Eight reps. Three things. Great set. Two, those were heavy as fuck to spot. And three, it feels very different spotting you than anyone else. I know. He's missed. He's, he starts to spot me. He's like, oh, shit, it's heavy. That's not, that doesn't give me confidence when I'm like this. When I went to a grab, I'm used to like an arm or like fabric. I felt just like this muscle, dude. <laughs> you don't really feel that normal. <laughs> it's a little oh. weirder to grip. <sighs> Oh, yes. There you go. Yes. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Again. Good. Down slow. Go to throw down nice and slow. Nice and slow. This is where it counts. This is where it counts. Hold it. Hold it. Pause. You see that? A little save. You pushed me. It's a scary set. Good. Oh. 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 
chest. Think chest. Think chest. Yes, good. Now so. Getting a mistake of, mm -hmm. they go too fast. Mm -hmm. They don't take long rest periods. I know you train alone a lot, and I, I do too, so I get in that habit. I'm not saying you gotta take long rest periods, but I have noticed the benefit of taking a little bit of a longer rest period and waiting yeah. to get into that set. That's something I could do better on for sure. Just because wait. I feel like when you, I explained it to him, when you rush a set, mm -hmm. odds are you're not gonna contract as hard as you think. Yeah. You're not gonna use as many reps as you think. Yep. And that's the whole point, right? Yeah. We're bodybuilders. Yeah. We're not CrossFit motherfuckers. <laughs> Training heavy is fun, but training heavy and being in tune is funner. Yeah. You know, it's one thing I like. People laugh at me now. They're like, you only lift 100 pound dumbbells? Yeah, well, look at me and look at you. Yeah. You know? That's, that's something like, trust me, I have no ego when it comes to heavy. No, that's good. You never want to hold back weight, yeah. though. On all, on it, like, don't be afraid to push yourself, but no, like, if you do a set, right? Because you want to push, and you're like, mm, I didn't really feel it. Yeah. Like, the pump, it wasn't and just do another set and do it lighter. That's the point of a back wall sometimes, but if your top set is that good, like I said, sometimes that's all you need, or you can just do the same weight again twice. Just take long, I, that's why I've become a big advocate of longer rest periods. <laughs> shit. Like, I don't feel this shit, right? Yeah. And then I would incorporate this specific way with everything. And I can, I feel everything different. And I'm sure if you know, like you don't, there's nothing on the elbow. There you go. No. There's, there's really no, 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 it's just all in the chest. chest. And that's the point. I think a lot of people, they don't emphasize that stretch in the pause. They yeah. just want to, yep. once you get that, and, get the palm, and like that's, that. exactly. Yeah. Wow. It's awesome. <laughs> my fucking hand sliding that whole set back and forth i was using my sweat to get me back in position i'd fucking start here i'd slide out here and then i'd come down go like this you like this i was able to yeah it's good i was able to make it fucking work i'm gonna get chalk next set holy shit it's not much it's maybe like a baby chicken breast but it's a pump though yeah it's a pump now with this set we're gonna switch it up a little bit where are you putting it in the stretch? The middle and the stretch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. Oh, fuck. Am I sweaty? You're sweaty. I got this on, luckily. <laughs> I'm putting them through it. 
I got a problem. One more. One more. Yep. Squeeze. <coughs> Down. I had Fuck. A, Fucking beautiful. I had a flicker the whole time. That's good. Oh. What fly machine is it? Oh, wow. You like Me? that one? No. <laughs> It's also good. These are nice, right? That is nice. It's good. Oh, good. Is that it there? Or another? It's good there. Now we'll go on to um, cable curl. Cool. Cable curl. I'll show you the way I like to do them. What the fuck? Did it hit you? Oh. I need your height, bro. <laughs> I got, I, I got two inches. I need your height. That's a full stretch. Then, On time. I'm not that much off. You were like, I'll get my last meal in at 10. Here comes midnight. <laughs> well, well, my day got a little delayed. Dude, it takes like 20 minutes to cook it in a blood one. So, cook earlier. Bro, but then I'm getting up every hour 45, and that's. I do it. I know. <laughs> I do it. If I know I gotta eat at 7 30, like if I gotta put like potatoes or something, now it's sweet potatoes, in the air fryer. I'm up by seven. Let them bitches sit. Come back. I need. It's so fucking. It's, I mean, you gotta do it. It's tedious. You gotta. All right, I'm thirsty. Oh, is it another bicep or is that it? Uh, we'll do one one set of um, seated arm curl. Oh. Oh. Thirty. As long as you feel they're productive, that's really all that matters, you know? For sure. Hey. So. Hey. I thought that was awesome. Just like, it's cool to take a step back and realize like the reality of it. Like, working out with you, right? Yeah. Oh, Top guy, competitive, master hey. your craft at this point. So like, being able to pick up hey. what you learned, it's gonna help me out in my career. Hey. So. Oh, it's, it's, you can never learn too much. I'm still yeah. learning. I know. You know, it's, that's why I, I decided to, um, you know, let, let Jared 
you know, train with me in the gym a while because I, he had his own method and for a while he wanted to do it on me. And every time we, we talked about doing it, I was, you know, close to a show and I'm like, I don't really want to change anything, you know. But after I did the Arnold, yep. I le we linked up, we did some training and I think his style, it's just improved me overall in terms of size, leanness, the, the structure of everything, my legs. So I was like, fuck it, I like it. But I'm also the guy that likes to train no failure. Yeah. So what all I did was incorporate his style with my intensity. Because with the RP style, it's full range, all full range, but more frequency. And I realized with the way I train, I don't know what, how to do an R&R. &R. I got them not good at reps and reserve. Okay. So I'd rather take their method just imply it with my type of intensity and maximize on that. And I realized doing it four days a week, it's been probably the best thing. So wow. you learn. Yeah. And once you're able to connect with your muscles that well, you'll begin to see like one day a week of it is really all you need. Like when I do chest, obviously, right? We do chest. And at the end, I do a little shoulder pump. Yep. That, that I, I like to do it just because, like I said in my other video, you don't really get sore side delts you know yeah. what i mean like your side delts ne like i never had a sore side delt i've had a sore front i've had a sore rear yeah. sides not really so can they be hit again sure but very little pump some blood and it keeps keeps it nice and full for the time being until you hit it again which is monday for me mm -hmm. and then on mondays on your shoulders i do the same thing for chest do a little exercise pump blood into it and then i'm good yeah and it works so Understood. you'll learn baby I don't know what I want to do yet, either a straight on or a turn or a twist. Is this how you do your glutes in this? Yeah. That. There's always that one side. My one side is all fucked up compared to the other one. <laughs> you gotta do it on stage. That would be the goal. You're definitely right where you need to be, six weeks. Yeah, you're good. Man, my hamstrings right in back poses. You are. You just, I think it's a muscle maturity thing for you. Yeah. So they're they're in like there's not like when I grabbed it they're hard they're not like I just think it's gonna be a maturity thing over time like yeah. mine but I think you're, you're where you need to be. Cool. Grew a lot, huh? He grew a lot. Gorilla. He grew a lot. Oh, I'm like, oh well, yeah, he's a small one. <laughs> he's a small gorilla. He's a baby gorilla. No, you put on a lot of size since I saw you, so it's awesome. All right, it's been a few hours at this point. It's 9 p.m. and during that workout, Nick said to me, he's like, oh, you're going to need a nap later. I was like, okay, like what? Like confused. And sure enough, that drive home, I napped that whole hour away home. I, took, I fell asleep. That workout kicked my ass. It was good. Really, really good workout. And that's pretty much it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah, that was the surprise guess. Nice. Don't, don't worry about it. That, was, that wasn't loud at all. I'm trying to, you know, I don't care. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the guests. We probably will be doing more workout videos in the future. Uh, good luck to Nick on his New York road to victory again, Olympic qualification prep. And <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow.